mo money is a tool, just like a handyman needs like a hammer to work. If I don't have money, I don't have any tools. I turned 10k into a bit over a million dollars. Uh, my name is Jonas Jelstad, and I'm a sports better, previous poker player, and basically trying to figure out what I want in life. I need to be able to separate working money and spending money, because, you know, as you move up the stakes, you play for big money, and then you can be like, oh, you know, that's just only like a couple of big blinds, so I'm just going to buy that, and I'm going to buy that. And some people become a bit blind on the money, because they're used to having such a big swings all the time. I feel like I was always pretty good to separate what was working money and what was spending money. I feel like I always respected the value of money and also, uh, for example, I've never bought a car because I've never needed a car. I've been living in big cities, I've been traveling so much and my, my cars is decreasing in value. Sure. So I'm better off just taking Ubers or, you know, mm -hmm. getting around it somehow and rather put my money into real estate instead of buying a Lamborghini and showing everyone, hey, look at me, I got money. I never had that like. Cool. But I think also having a significant amount of money, you should take then a bit less risks because it's actually like, it means something. It's money that you, that you care about. Obviously you care about 100k also, I'm not saying that. But it's, I'm in my 20s and I want to create freedom for myself. And I know if I'm going to be like the best and competing with the best and knowing my max potential, I would need money to like be able to create and do things I would like to do later on in life. I've been having a lot of fun in the summer, been going to Ibiza, Las Vegas, Los Angeles, some festival in Norway. And you know, in order to be motivated, you also need to reward yourself. And I think that's an important part of the game. Money can only do so much. Money is like a tool to give you freedom. And I think it's important to also use that freedom and don't be too caught up in the work. Obviously, you need to be focused about your work but there's nothing wrong with taking like a cup like a week off every now and then and just like this is what I can do this is how my future is going to be like and then just remind yourself like this is what you work for